Unei are tunneling carnivores covered in incredibly thick armored plates. They're 12 feet long and 9 feet tall, including their massive dorsal plate. This plate sticks out of the ground as they burrow just beneath the surface, giving them their nickname of land shark. Their origins are completely unknown, with some claiming they're made by wizards mixing armadillos with snapping turtles and demon blood. Personally, I would have tried an armored shark with a badger just looking at them, but we don't have any recorded cases of that actually being true. Bule go from conception to hatched within the span of a single day, so it appears like they just occasionally spawn out of nowhere or a wizard tower, but actually they're just growing really fast. Bule wander temperate hills and territories up to 30 miles wide, attacking anything edible regardless of its strength. They don't know fear, they're able to swim through soil like a running draft horse and jump high enough to rip at a giant's throat, so good luck running. A better idea would be to hide, they typically stay burrowed until they sense prey, so stay off the ground through flying or swimming. This only works when they're underground though, they actually have great vision when there's not dirt in their way. Once a bullet has noticed you, they'll launch themselves full force, knocking you down and laying into you with rows of teeth. They're about as smart as a deer and rarely encounter anything that can actually threaten them, so their tactics don't really go beyond eat the close one. The main exceptions are horses and halflings, which are favorite foods and are targeted first if possible. They hate the taste of dwarves and refuse to eat elves, but they might kill a few before remembering that. They will try to eat anything else though, armor and all, even if you're far stronger. Granted, few things are, their natural armor is just shy of plate mail with great constitution and strength to go alongside it. The Bunei's Bite is one of the hardest hitting attacks in their CR, taking many adventurers down in a single hit, but with only one per round they don't actually deal that much damage comparatively. The exception to this is their deadly leap, but that only targets a 10 foot square so it's easy enough to avoid. If you ever find yourself in Bunei country, Country, just remember to stay off the ground and bring a few spare horses as bait. Or if nothing else, throw the halfling at them. That's all for today's lesson. Let me know if you liked it. Subscribe for more courses below. Class dismissed.